Dauphin Volcano in Ethiopia's Afar region has erupted a new vent, ejecting powerful jets of steam, mud, and rocks. This dangerous escalation follows months of intense earthquake swarms, indicating magma intrusion beneath the surface. A video from the Kesem area shows gas and steam violently escaping, suggesting a phreatic explosion caused by magma heating groundwater. This could be Dauphin's first recorded eruption. The volcano, standing 1,151 meters high, has shown signs of activity before, but was considered dormant. Ground uplift of up to 30 centimeters confirms magma is moving closer to the surface. Smaller tremors continue to shake the region, adding to instability. Cracks emitting steam and hot water have appeared, confirming high subsurface heat. Immediate action is required. The potential for a large-scale eruption is high. Communities near Dauphin and Fantail volcanoes must prepare for possible evacuations. The lack of comprehensive monitoring means the true scale of the threat may be underestimated. Authorities must act swiftly to protect lives and infrastructure. The Afar region in northeastern Ethiopia is a beautiful place, but it's also home to volcanoes. One of these volcanoes, Mount Dauphin, has been quiet for a long time, but recently, it's been showing signs of waking up. This has caused thousands of people to leave their homes and go to safer places. The evacuation is a safety measure to make sure people are safe if the volcano erupts. It's a big job, and many government groups and helpers are working together to move people to safety. The Ethiopian government is working hard to help and has sent resources to the region. Other countries are also helping by sending aid and experts. This situation shows how important it is to be ready for disasters and to act quickly when they happen. The reason people are being evacuated from the Afar region is because of earthquakes. There have been a lot of earthquakes in the area recently. At first they were small, but they've been getting stronger and happening more often. On January 4, 2025, there was a big earthquake, magnitude 5.8. It was the strongest earthquake in the area for a long time and reminded everyone about the power of the Earth. Along with the earthquakes, there have been other signs of danger. Scientists notice changes in the ground around Mount Dauphin, which means that magma might be rising inside. Smoke and ash have also been seen coming out of the volcano. These signs mean that the volcano might erupt, so the authorities decided to evacuate people from the area. It was a tough decision but they had to keep people safe from a possible disaster. The Ethiopian government is taking action to handle the situation in the Afar region. The Ethiopian Disaster Risk Management Commission is the group in charge of disaster response, and they're working hard to keep everyone safe. The leader of the commission, Shifara Teklamerium, has been talking to the public and explaining what the government is doing. He understands that people are scared because they had to leave their homes, but he wants everyone to know that the evacuation is just a precaution. Nobody knows for sure if Mount Dauphin will erupt, but the government is getting ready just in case. Commissioner Teklamarium said it's important to stay alert and listen to the authorities. While people are being evacuated, Scientists are keeping a close eye on Mount Dauphin to see if it will erupt. They are using special tools to track the volcano's activity, like checking for earthquakes, gas, and changes in the ground. This information helps them make decisions and keep people safe. Even though scientists are doing their best, it's hard to know for sure what Mount Dauphin will do. Volcanoes are unpredictable. It might calm down and go back to sleep, or it might erupt with a lot of force. The people of the Afar region and the scientists who are helping them have to wait and see what happens, hoping for the best but preparing for the worst.